Booming Thunder Radio, where we groove as the spirit moves. Yeah. Drawing the honey from the rock with the righteous Reverend Doctor on Booming Thunder Radio. Hello, mighty friends. Welcome to a little bit of honey from the rock on the Sabbath day. Yeah, I hope you are rejoicing with your family, that your family and is loving all the earth together, holy, set apart. He magnified by a number unknown by mortal men, an everlasting hope, ye, the glory of God in our hearts, ye, that the truth, the hope of glory, which is the love of the truth in a man's heart, ye, that he would give it unto his family, yeah, and to that mama ego that he loves. Yeah, our journey has taken us to many places. But New Orleans was the one that always tried to take us down. Calling out to us. Yeah, the darkness clutching as we walk with our loving wife through the forest. The stones banging off bedroom windows. Rain and heavy dew upon the streets in the morning. In the fence, the rods of iron in Jackson Square, in Washington's compass, arcing across its side. But what is this union that Jackson? Did he have it with five? Hmm? A demon crapping on the land? Hmm? Or an upright man who is wicked inside? Even in our blindness as we wander in the promised land, crashing into one another, pointing fingers, pushing buttons, and setting, yeah, flax on fire, giving it as a gift, yeah, like the satellite button yeah, under those nails that shine. And Washington's cannons, yeah, the machine guns hidden inside. Yeah, make the stallions of Jackson yeah, like the Jacksons of five. The cathedral and the steeple and the ash upon the children's faces. Yeah. The rods of iron, the olive branches in the corner. Yeah, 
switch the demon's legs there night and day. Now be careful when you go into that 1718 uncompassed square for the Ark of the Covenant needs to be in you before you dare to go within the rods of iron before that cathedral yeah, where the light flickers on and off yeah, as they go from the right and to the left. Now down in San Antone where the golden eagle nests that day Yea, where all the broods of the young, the mighty, yea, the sea hawks, the golden eagles, and the dolphins that swim alongside the whales every day. Yea, let us open the word together forever like Alamo standing in their day. Our brother's stone mason work all around in front, yeah, stacked, yeah. How many cubits wide is before your gate? Yeah, what is fought for in your Alamo? kind of coonskin cap are you wearing down there? Hmm? Are you Daniel, my brother? The one that's so good to me? Yeah. The one that brings forth the snow and the rain? Crossing over, yeah, like walking on the waters of the Galilee, yeah, Washington's cannons, Daniel Boone's musket rifle, and in the same year that San Antonio and New Orleans were established, Their cathedrals stand with great pride. Yeah, the fleecing of the flock yeah, is seen all around. Y'all come on in by St. Louis. Yeah, we got an ark for each and every one to walk under. Yeah, and receive a darkness of the crowning clowns. Opening the word of Proverbs in the 17, like grains of time. Yeah. That day that it was, some 300, uh, yeah, grains of sand to go. Like sands in the hourglass. These are the days of our lives. Better is a dry morsel and quietness with it than a whole house full of feasting with strife. A servant who acts wisely will rule over a son who acts shamefully and will share in the inheritance among brothers. The refining pot is for silver and the furnace for gold. But Yahovah tests 
hearts. An evildoer listens to wicked lips. A liar pays attention to a destructive tongue. He who mocks the poor taunts his maker. He who rejoices at calamity will not go unpunished. Oh, forgive us, Father, for these things put before the righteous and the unrighteous that test the heart. May we be strengthened to always choose wisely. Grandchildren, oh, our great treasure upon the earth, are the crown of their old grandfathers, yea, these old men. And the glory of sons is their fathers. Hallelujah! Exodus 20 and 12 liken to Proverb 2012. Excellent speech is not fitting for a fool, much less are lying lips to a prince. A bribe is a charm in the sight of its owner. Wherever he turns, he prospers. He who conceals a transgression seeks love, but he who repeats a matter separates intimate friends. A rebuke goes deeper into one who has understanding than a hundred blows into a fool. Do you hear? A rebellious man seeks only evil. So a cruel messenger will be sent against him this very day. Let a man meet a bear robbed of her cubs rather than a fool in his folly. He who returns evil for good, evil will not depart from his house. The beginning of strife is letting out water, so abandon the quarrel before it breaks out. He who justifies the wicked and he who condemns the righteous both of them are like both of them alike are an abomination. He who justifies the wicked and he who condemns the righteous, both of them yeah, alike one to another, and are an abomination to Mariahova. Why is there a price in the hand of a fool to buy wisdom when he has no sense? If he only had two pence in his pocket, he could give all like a widow that might. Pour the oil into all the rebirthed, reimagined, repaired, restored men of glory when their mothers. Poured in the gold and righteousness.
fragrance of the oil and not the blackness of the burning of the bush found down below. A friend loves at all times and a brother is born for adversity. Thank you, brother, for the adversity. A man lacking in sense pledges and becomes guarantee in the presence of his neighbor. He who loves transgression loves strife. And who raises his door seeks destruction. He who has a crooked mind finds no good. And he who is perverted in his language falls into evil. He who sires a fool does so to his own sorrow. And the father of a fool has no joy. A joyful heart is good medicine. But a broken spirit dries up the bones. A wicked man receives a bribe from the bosom. Do you understand? To pervert the ways of justice, yea, the bosoms are brought forth. Yeah, let them be blossoms, tender sweet scents of purity in the field, the toiling of the lilies seen upon the gentle breeze in the green pasture this day. Wisdom is in the presence of the one who has understanding, but the eyes of a fool are on the end of of the earth. A foolish son is a grief to his father and bitterness to her who bore him. It is also not good to find the righteous nor to strike the noble for their uprightness. He who restrains his words has knowledge, and he who has a cool spirit, yea, groovy is a man of understanding. Yea, be groovy, mighty friends. But even a fool when he keeps silent, is considered wise. When he closes his lips, he is prudent. Yea, a job application can be found in uh, Building 13, Room 5. In the Praetor, uh, sanitary, uh, uh, the, uh, 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 well, in the house of Mighty Yehovah. Yeah, take it inside a little dry morsel and eat it like a crumb. Yeah, like, like a dog lapping crumbs from a table.
It was 17 and then 18. And Washington was ready for the trip. He who separates himself seeks desire. He quarrels against all sound wisdom. Yeah, as the train whistle blows outside. A fool does not delight in understanding, but only in revealing his own mind. When a wicked man comes, contempt also comes. And with dishonor, scorn. Walk with honor, mighty friend. Wisdom is as wisdom does. The words of a man's mouth are deep waters. The fountain of wisdom is a bubbling brook. To show partiality to the wicked is not good. Do you hear? To thrust aside the righteous in judgment. Fool's lips bring strife. Do you hear? And his mouth calls for blows. Yeah. Be wise and never rage like the heathen in the outer courts. Yeah. Pray, humbling yourself each morning, seeking the kingdom of light. And the Son of Righteousness, the Spirit of Truth in our hearts yeah, and in our minds. A fool's mouth is his ruin, and his lips are the snare of his very soul. The words of a whisperer are like dainty morsels. And they go down into the innermost parts of the body. He, he also who is slack in his work is brother to him who destroys. The name of Yahovah is a strong tower. The righteous runs into it and is safe. Hallelujah, Yehovah. And the everlasting glory of his son, Yahushua, in our hearts. Yea, being poured into by our loving bride. It has the, ye, all the oil for every clean vessel ye forgiven repented ye that waits ye for the gate to open at the narrow way of justice and truth and honor and thanksgiving for the glory the indwelling of the divine presence in each of our lives within each of our hearts. Yea, like a keyhole and a lock. Yea, in the darkness, heard, heard with a click. Do you get the picture? 
A rich man's wealth is his strong city. Yeah, the temple within. Yeah, the strong tower. And like a high wall in his own imagination, a rich man's wealth is this strong city. Before destruction, the heart of man is haughty. But humility before honor be like water. Yeah. Seeping into the cracks. Yeah, let the whirling and whisking of the word everlasting by the finger of Maria Hovah write the word of truth upon each of our hearts. Yea, in his perfect time. He who gives an answer before he hears. It is folly and shame to him. The spirit of a man can endure his sickness. But a broken spirit, who can bear it? Can you bear it, mighty friend? Yea, the sickness. Yea, mirroring back magnified beyond imagination upon those that would dare taunt a line towards the righteous as spoken in the word this very day. Yea, it is folly and shame to him and the spirit, yea, that broken spirit, they'll never be able to bear it, will they? Will you? The mind of the prudent acquires knowledge. A man's gift makes room for him. Do you hear? A man's gift. A man's gift. A man's gift. A man's gift. A man's gift makes room for him and brings him before great men. The first to plead his case right. Another comes and examines him. The lot puts an end to strife and decides between the mighty ones. Yeah, like two mercury head dimes from 1939. A brother offended Brother offended is harder to be one than a strong city, and contentions are like the bars of a citadel. Yea, may the love of the truth and with a repentance and forgiveness. Yeah, this unimaginable gift of grace that we can hug and love. Yeah, even the blind that persecute us, y'all. Come not before us on the Sabbath day or ever touch our children. For the spirit of truth, ye grieve not the spirit. For 
our father has had way plenty and enough. Ain't no doubt about it, y'all. Now he sent this this everlasting how could you not want to be in the everlasting glory that you want to work inequity and fornication and unimaginable abominations and stand upright before men Hypocrites. Yeah, let the righteous shine as the firmament in the sun and beam from the heart of their children. Yeah, let their children run, laugh, and play even in their blindness. May the glory of God be seen in these, yeah, jewels of the deep with the fruit yea the fruit of a man's mouth his stomach will be satisfied he will be satisfied with the product of his lips. Yeah. Proverbs 14 and 14. Yeah. They burn with fire at their hips and their lips. Death and life are in the power of the tongue. And those who love it will eat its fruit. Do you hear? He who finds a wife finds a good thing and obtains favor from Mariahova. Genesis 2.18 and Proverbs 8.35 for a double portion. Ye, all the live long day. Ye, that an omer can be in each humbled heart. On the Sabbath day, that none would be left over, yea, that the oil would pour until there were no willing vessels left. The poor man utters supplications, but the rich man answers roughly. A man of friends. Yeah, a man of too many friends comes to ruin and is confused upon each and every side. But there is a friend who sticks closer than a brother. Yeah, and he is found in Proverbs 17 and... 17, the spirit of truth, yea, may it reveal the treasured souls of our children, yea, in the hearts of our wife, that she can be seen all this next week in the spirit of truth within her heart, pouring forth the golden anointing oil into our children and upon all the sons of love, repented hearts, yea, coming forth, yea, the spirit of Elijah.
as you hovered over them as Elisha did. Yea, in the mystery of heaven. Yea, upon this day and upon these moments in the everlasting glory revealed by the hope of glory in the tabernacle of a Sabbath day, rejoicing with our children, even in the Colosseum. Yea, we go forth with our sword, ye scabbard, like a lightsaber, May it never be heard or seen coming forth.